Hi, Soul Family. I am just going to do a quick reading. I was moving my, my, I move things around on my desk all the time. It, it, it refreshes the energy and um, I look at the pieces that the mountain has given me and the different pieces of crystal and different things that have been, I've been given and they mean things to me. I, I love crystals. I hold them. I watch them. I look at them. I feel them. First item you can choose from is the tiger. Can you see that? It's kind of hard with the background, right? Anyway, this is a tiger I found up on my Sugarloaf Summit. There's his nose, there's his eye, there's his ear, right? Tiger. And then there's this beautiful piece of druzy. Okay, I've got to be able to show you this so that you can actually see how beautiful it is. Can you see in there? You see it glistening? I love this. Jersey is so, be so beautiful. Um, and then I have, what else do we want to display today? How about this gorgeous piece? This is mica, but it's a special type. It's a special type of it's muscovite, but it's a special orb type. So incredible, love that. There's that. And then we're gonna pop out of the circuit and we're gonna just do an entire crystal cluster. This is my crystal cluster that represents me. I asked, I was in West Fork Trail and I asked Spirit for a special stone. I don't ever take them, I'm, I have to be given them. And I looked down and there was this cat Look at with the crystal eyes. Isn't it amazing? One ear is down listening to the ancestors. This is Anasazi pottery. This says, imagine what your life could be like. These diamonds coming out of the, of the cave where the Puff the Magic Dragon lives. And Puff's holding on to a crystal ball. Interesting. I'm going to have to move that because the crystal ball has just been misplaced. It goes over here. Hmm. So something needs to be readjusted in my life. I have selenite, which is a clearing and charging crystal. It's self-charging, self-clearing. I have pyrite, which is protection. And I have danburite crystal in the back. I have raw lapis lazuli. And it's all on a beautiful piece of granite from Idlewild, California, one of my favorite places. I'm gonna have to fix that. My little crystal ball has come off. So I'm not imagining things in the right way, I guess or having faith in, in what I can manifest. So maybe the, we'll see what comes up in the reading. This is gonna be a really fast reading. Spirit said, short and sweet. Relinquish control to the universe is the first message. Or control of, or don't let anyone else could try to control you. Don't be a puppet on somebody else's string. So the guidance that we're gonna get today is from the Spirit Oracle. This is by Tony Carmine Salerno. It's one of my oldest decks and I love it. Please clear my deck, Spirit. Thank you. For those who chose the Druzy, can you show us the most important message for all? For those who chose the Druzy, let me just make sure we don't get disturbed by my work line. Correct for neutrality on all levels. For those who chose the Druzy, which is this piece right here. Any clear quartz crystal like that is a manifestation stone. It's also a boosting stone so that any other energy of the stones of the other energy around it are amplified. So it's really cool. So for those who chose the Druzy, Spirit, thank you. <laughs> Moon Goddess. Okay, I gotta make sure that you guys, there you go, there she is. So she's vulnerable. Things are quite emotional. There's a lot of energy shifting around her, but she's staying connected to her highest self. She's listening to her highest self. And Spirit says, you're in a time of necessary upheaval. So everything feels a little bit frenetic right now, right? You're feeling vulnerable, exposed, not quite sure what the hell. But there's a blessing in disguise here. And as this dust begins to settle down, the gift reveals itself. Spirit has been saying there's a gift on its way. Short and sweet. Someone's saying, I've been taking some time. I've had my eyes on the prize. Ain't watching nobody else. Your love, it hit me hard. You're bad for my health. But I love the cards I've been dealt. <laughs> okay, check this out. Look at the back of my Jersey piece. 
It's already beautiful like this. I just flipped it over and look at the chunks of crystals in there. Oh, I'm gonna put it that way down. It's so beautiful. So that was for the Druzy people. And this song comes along for the Druzy people as well. All right, for the ones who to chose the tiger, for the tiger from Sugarloaf Summit, for those who chose the tiger, this has not been touched or oiled or anything. This is just the color of the mountain. Isn't it beautiful? I love it so much. There's a snake on the back, which represents healing and transformation. So spirit, whoa, moon goddess again. So those who chose the Druzy and for those who chose the tiger get the same message. As the dust settles, you're gonna see your, your uh, blessing. Woo! All right, correct for neutrality. But since we just got that one, I'm gonna ask for another one. Three fell, so that's too many. Short and sweet, spirit. Let's make this short and sweet. Correct for neutrality on our levels. What is the best message for those who chose the tiger? Correct for neutrality on all levels. For those who chose the tiger, what is... Oh my God, seriously? Come on. So what's in interesting is this keeps coming out. Mm, okay, they said to take them all, so we're going to take them all. But what came out again was this one, the blessing in disguise. And then this one, regret. There's nothing sadder than looking back at a part of your life and wishing that you had done something or had said something. Why didn't I do that? Why did I waste all this time? So spirit says, go for it. Sometimes it's better to try and fail than to not try at all. All is not lost. You still have time to turn the situation around, whatever it is. You might be feeling like, ugh, but you can turn this around. You can turn it around by letting go of fear and apprehension and following your heart. The other message that comes with it is holiday. The spirit of the ocean calls you, offering healing and much needed peace. Come to the water and connect with its endless flow of magic. You need a change of scenery. Take a holiday and all's gonna fall into place. This mermaid needs to be near the ocean. That's interesting. That's a long ways away for me to go. I'm getting prickles all in my hands though. So I'm gonna stop and I'm gonna ask quickly from my deck for the first two messages. Oh Lord, where are you? Hiding gone the back of the back behind there. So this is the Naked Truth 333. So for those who chose the Druzy, what was the message spirit that's most applicable? Just two messages, the most important messages. Please guide my hands to the most important messages. For the Druzy, Druzy people, they are in a very low vibrational energy and they're unhappy. Hmm, they could be like this, right? Water is the greatest conductor of energy. So you can have a sea salt bath. Tonight I'll do that. I can't get to the ocean right now. It's asking me to take a holiday though. Or actually I didn't choose the tiger. I chose the Druzy. So someone else needs to get take a holiday or get to the ocean and put their wishes in the ocean and send it out, right? Actually, that's not, that's not the tiger people. Oh, well I'm saying it, this might be them that they know. This is for the people who chose the Druzy. And that something's very upsetting and, 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 and twisted all around, but it's, there's a reason for it happening. And there's a blessing in disguise and something wonderful, a gift is on its way. Stop and smell the roses. So stop, breathe, take a breath, get outside, right? Relax, slow down, take your time. Okay, for those who chose the tiger, the ones who are being told that the same thing is happening, they're in upset disarray as well, but the, the dust is settling soon and a gift will be there. They're being told not to regret something. Go for it, try, whatever it is. It's best to try and not fail. What if you didn't do it? And the answer was gonna be yes. Oh my God, it's like me with a house across the street. They told me no, but I really want that cabin. I want a cabin and it's convenient and it's here right now and it's in my perfect place. And so I wrote to them. I actually let, sent a voice message. Spirit guided me to do it. And I said, don't, don't respond right now. Just let yourselves think about it. If the answer is still no, I respect that. But I've been told by spirit not to give up, right? Better to try than to not try and find out the answer could have been yes. And the fellow saved the message. He didn't just let it go, he saved it. So it was something he's thinking about. So for those who chose the tiger, big happy changes are coming. You might be regretting something, worried about something, stressed out. It's completely chaotic, but there's a gift about to happen. And maybe you're going to go on a holiday. Maybe that's going to be part of it. But whatever it is, big happy changes. Big happy changes generally represent new relationship, new car, new home, 
new uh, person entering your life, new job. Those are the big happy changes that it generally re refers to, so nice. I trust you completely. Wow, that's, that's a really, that's a really big honor. That makes me very emotional. Trust is not something that's earned easily. And when somebody trusts you completely, that's a complete honor. I would be honored with those words being spoken to me. For those who chose the Muscovite mica, I can't remember the, or the orb. Uh, I should look it up. Muscovite mica is just so powerful and so important and so healing. Correct for neutrality. I choose it. I love it. I know how important it is. It helps with depression and anxiety. It's, oh, it's amazing. Correct for neutrality on all levels. Oop, there we go. Thank you, Spirit. I like it when you do that. No, two, no, no, we can't keep doing three. <laughs> I heard, yes, you can. Okay, fine. The artist in you is about to emerge. Look at that war paint. You are an infant power of creation. You are an internal artist. Connect to your third eye. There's all three eyes open. Open all three eyes and create something beautiful today. Maybe in a thought, a manifestation. You can create with energy, you can create with words, you can actually paint, draw, garden, you can do anything. So feel the stars shining on you. You are one with nature and the universe and eternal light shines through you forever. You're being encouraged. Wow, a new direction. I chose this, right? Life might seem like a whirlwind at the moment, yet there is, a div in is divine order to the present circumstance. What may appear as chaos is often the angelic forces of the universe at work. After the storm clears, you will be steered in a new direction, a time of renewal, health, joy, and abundance. I needed to hear this. I needed to hear this. The journey, interesting. Look at the ocean, or is that a great lake? But there's a rainbow over that. Do you know what this reminds me of? In Wisconsin, on this side, which is the peninsula, we drive up and, and we're, we're going along Bay For Bayshore Drive and you look across the water and there's Potawatomi Park and the, and the other side there, a rainbow. So you're soaring to new heights. Spirit wants you to experiment, they want you to play. They want you, your spirit, to be allowed to, to revel in the freedom of exploring and exciting new and exciting things and possibilities for your life. Daydream, right? Follow the rainbow across the horizon. A pot of gold awaits. Wow, the pot of gold's on that side. The mountains. So Spirit, what is the, a message that will help clarify what these cards are meaning for those who chose the Muscovite mica? Hide my hands, please, Spirit. It's a matter of days. Oh, wow. A matter of days, something's gonna happen. A matter of days. That's awesome. I said to, Spirit said to me, there's happy surprise on its way. There's a gift. And you're gonna, and you're gonna be shown something. And I walked to the mailbox and I put mail. Uh, so the mail came back to me. It was sent to my grandson and it said in de deliver, undeliverable. And I thought, what? So I, I re readdressed it and put it back. And I lifted up the, the little mailbox thing and I said, you got mail. And I said, today, you're gonna hear something. You're gonna understand something. You're gonna know something very soon. And Spirit's confirming that with now days. I love that, thank you. Not for you, I'm sorry. So maybe that house is not for me. Hmm, maybe it's something else. There's a gift coming though, isn't there? So whatever it is for you, not for you, I'm sorry. Maybe you're gonna say that to someone, I don't know. And then the last message that we're gonna work with is the crystal cluster. I love this, I absolutely choose this, this is my life. Correct for neutrality on all levels. Or maybe something that you were thinking of is not for you, like I was thinking, do I get a little schoolie bus and build it out? Do I do that? Do I travel to Wisconsin and see my family and friends and, and be creative in that way. But maybe Spirit's saying that's not for you. But I'll know within days, won't I? Correct for neutrality on all levels. Song right now, that's my man, wreck my plans. <laughs> you got plans, you're moving in a direction, but you're not, let, and you're not letting anybody treat you like a puppet on a string. Spirit says, hey, that's my man, wreck my plans. 
So my plan's to do this, that, or the other. If you want to wreck them, but I'm not going to stop moving forward. For those who chose the cat cluster, I do. What is the most applicable message? The most helpful, most easily understood message for the most amount of people that choose the crystal cluster, the cat crystal cluster. I'm not good at doing it sideways. Cat for neutrality, spirit. Show me, make it very clear. Good Lord, no, nope. how many are here? No, that's too many. Correct for neutrality on all levels. Correct for neutrality. Next time, if that many drops, I'll take them because maybe Spirit really wanted all, all of those messages to be seen. If they did, they'll give them to me again. Correct for neutrality on all levels. Correct for neutrality on all levels. <laughs> no, that many? Oh my God, okay, well, I said I would take them. So, first one is passion, love, sexual energy, vital life force, kundalini. Look at her, she's on fire. Her, her kundalini is awakened and it's drawing towards her what she's emitting. The sun, giver of life, a strength, a gift. Here again, a gift. New infusion of energy, something beyond your control, so surrender to it. Ooh. Heart's desire, you're being showered with love. Your time of waiting will soon be over. All your heart's deepest desires will be filled. Dang, dude. Speak your truth. Stand up for what you believe in, regardless of the current circumstances, regardless of the consequences. Speak your truth, regardless of what others might think. It's time for you to stand in your own power and shine for all the world to see. This is Emotional breakthrough. Ooh, I like this a lot. Look at the trees, the forest. Emotional transformation, release, freedom. It's safe for you to express how you feel. Let it all out. Relationships deepen as a result. Look at that light coming from the dark forest, right? That sun is about to rise again. Instincts. She's concerned, thinking, hmm, I don't know. Well, follow your natural instincts. You're making the current situation more complicated than it needs to be. Trust in the universe, allow your intuition to guide you. You're always safe. That's true, that's absolutely true. That's why we got relinquished control. Don't try to control things, just allow. Forgiveness, somebody's been hung at the stake here. It's time to heal old wounds. Forgiveness is required. Do not allow yourself to be a victim any longer. Maybe that's you carrying around the weight of the world, the sins of the world that aren't yours to carry. For in doing so, you only hurt yourself. You're eternally loved. Embrace the love that is being offered and allow it to heal you. Nice. And then reflection. Reflect upon and bless all the wondrous times in your life. Give thanks for the many blessings you receive each and every day. You can connect energetically to those you love. Simply feel them in your heart. Life is beautiful. There's a lot going on there. Correct for neutrality and all level spirit. Can you simplify things by these clarifications? Show me the one to go to. Don't be his or her friend. They're using you. Wow. Don't offer yourself as a freaking victim. They're using you. Follow your instincts. Stand your ground. Speak your freaking truth. Dang, right? Correct for neutrality on all levels. Who's using me? Don't be their friend. They're using you. Because I chose this. Or maybe I'm supposed to say that to someone. No, it's me. And they're feeling guilty. Wow, they're using you and they're feeling guilty or someone's feeling guilty. That's the emotional breakthrough, right? Release, freedom, it's safe to express how you feel. Let it out. All relationships will deepen when you speak your truth because your time of waiting is over very, very soon and all that it, that it is that you've been asking for, it's gonna come because your Kundalini is reawakening. This is something beyond your control. Spirit says surrender it, relinquish control. I need to clarify just a little bit more. One more, two, Spirit says, because there were so many cards here. Do not settle for less, ever. <laughs> you deserve the best. Do not settle for less. Someone's using you. Don't settle for less than you deserve. Correct for neutrality. Don't be a puppet on somebody's string. 
You are a work in progress. Good job. Well, my twin said that to me. We're all a work in progress, aren't we? Yep, and you're doing a great job. So don't let anybody use you. Don't let them be, be their puppet on the string. They're feeling guilty, or maybe you are, because you deserve better than what you're dealing with, and don't settle, right? Emotional breakthrough. Follow your gut instinct. Do not offer yourself as a victim. Damn. All right, I'm gonna meditate on these, and I suggest that you do as well, because there were a lot of cards there that came out, and there's a lot to think about. So what I, I wanted to tell you that somebody posted a message on my page. I shared a card, and the card said, um, the card said, there are no obstacles in your way. Follow your heart. The path is safe. The way ahead is clear. Have faith. That wanted to be heard. Um, the person's, the, the message was surprise. Something, some, a surprise is on the way. Something hap wonderful is about to happen. And the person said, good luck if you think that there's a surprise for everybody. And I'm like, wow, thanks. You know what? You're blocked because I don't need negativity on my page. Thank you very much. When we get a message like this or when we get cards and we see something, if spirit has already said something to you or you already have a gut instinct in regards to something and then you see a card like that, that message is for you, right? It's confirmation. I posted something this morning and somebody said, oh my God, that's exactly what's happening right at this moment. Thank you so much. That message is for me. You know when a message is for you by body chills, by the way that your body reacts. When I get, you can't fake chills. They happen, and it's, it's, it's your body speaking to you, so trust what you get. Somebody is saying, I, I'm, not, I'm not worrying about you hurting right now because you hurt me first. Maybe that's what you need to say. Somebody's like, oh, crying the blues, but this is their karma. This is what they brought upon themselves, and Spirit says, you will have an emotional breakthrough. If you speak your truth, don't allow yourself to be a victim anymore, and do not allow them to suck you back in. This chaos is happening on purpose so that you can move in a new direction. But first you need to recognize that you deserve the best. So something wonderful is happening. Something, something positive is on a way. Yeah, well, this is positive. This information is positive. So don't leave any negative messages like that on my page or you'll be removed. I am not here to put out negative energy. I'm here to put out positive energy and to put out Messages from spirit that give people hope. And what's so wrong with believing that something wonderful is happening? That's how you manifest. Something wonderful is happening. But for me, in a matter of days, I'm going to know something. In a matter of days. And I trust spirit. And they're going to come through with that. So believe the best. Because what you focus on, you manifest. And there's a rhyme. All right, you guys, I love you. If I can help you with any dream analysis, private readings, crystal clusters, anything on my page, my website is www.theangelswhisper.com and my email address is sherrycolumbus at yahoo.com. Have a blessed day.